In this video, I will show you how to auto-tune in Studio One. So I've got a few clips here. I've got a nice sung jingle. Remixes only. And a nice voiceover right here. KYZX FM. And we're going to have some fun with this. So first and foremost, I'd recommend you go over to the browse and get installed plugins from Anteras. They have great auto-tune plugins and they're actually available via the link in the description. You can sign up for a 14-day free trial and really test this stuff to the limits. So probably the best auto-tune plugin out there is Auto-Tune Pro that they make. And we can drag and drop it onto our beautiful singer. And then we can start to change the settings on this. So if I play it back now and have a listen... Remixes only. You'll hear and see how it's auto tuning our singer, which is great. Remixes only. And if you want to get that real auto tune sound, either on a voice or a sung vocal, turn the retune speed up. Remixes only. And you can hear that real kind of like rapper style auto tune. We can humanize the voice a bit more. Remixes only. And if we change the vibrato, we're going to get really wobbly here. Remixes <laughs> so that's probably a little too far but you get the idea if you know the key and you know the scale you're working in that's great you can pop that in and make everything work absolutely perfectly now uh, i don't claim to be a singer myself but i could go ahead and start a new track hitting the t key here and we'll call this mic tune like that and i'm just going to arm this track to record, record like so and uh, then we'll we'll maybe mute these other tracks out so they don't interfere let's record this Remixes only. And let's play that back now and hear what we've got. Remixes only. And then I can drag Autotune Pro onto my voice and let's see what it's going to do to it. Remixes only. Now, if I go ahead and turn the retune speed up. Remixes only. You'll hear how something's going on. Now, if I really lock it into a key and a scale, let's put it in C major. Remixes only. You get that kind of auto-tune sound, and if you started to sing, it would start to auto-tune your voice. So it's really, really cool. But it doesn't stop there. I've got another little piece here. If I unmute this track. KYZX FM. And we can do the auto-tune vocodist effect, which is really cool. And there's a big guide for it because it's a huge plugin. But we can just go through some of the presets. Uh, that's up here at the top. There's tons of them that we can bring in. Let's see if we can scan through and find them. Here we go. Let's uh, actually load in some of the presets. They are actually showing just down here, not actually at the top, but actually inside the plugin. That's where you need to look. And we can go for, let's go for one of these. Let's go for double tracked and see how that impacts the audio now. KYZX FM. So you can hear it double tracked. We can go for some other stuff called chorus. Ooh. Wow. That's pretty loud, isn't it? Let's try something else. Something from Damien Lewis. Let's go for Siri and see how that sounds. That's pretty cool. And of course, I can do this on this piece of audio as well. If I go ahead and move this up to this track. Uh, so let's go ahead and grab that and put that over here. We'll make sure that track's still muted. Play back. Wow, that's really cool, isn't it? So lots of cool auto-tune style effects we can do. Let's go for Coho here and see how that sounds. Remixes only. So you can hear that there's lots of singing, tuning plugins you can get. This uh, is called Auto-Tune Vocodist, by the way, from Antares. Remixes only. So tons of stuff you can do with Auto-Tune, not only using Auto-Tune Pro, but also I highly recommend checking out Auto-Tune Vocodist. They're all part of a free trial from Antares. They play really well with Studio One and uh, yeah, definitely have some fun doing it. And if you're enjoying Studio One, go and check out another tutorial like Splitting Tracks. It's on your screen now and learn more about Studio One right now.